His face is grotesque, clownish in the style of the artist. Imposing at five by four feet, Bada Meng's painting, Armats, centers on a grinning figure. The final face is wide-eyed with intoxication and overflowing hair. This papal figure holds a cannabis joint. The work is a reinterpretation of Diego Velasquez's 16th century Baroque painting of Pope Innocent X. Dubbed one of the finest portraits ever created, the pontiff is depicted with a menacing expression. In detailed realism, the dominantly red tones complement his cutthroat glare. The image boasts of his position in power. The influence of this painting is seen in versions by multiple artists. Possibly most notable is Francis Bacon's study after Velasquez's portrait of Pope Innocent X. 300 years later, the Irish artist created nearly 50 variations of the study. In this painting, Pope Innocent screams silently. His mouth gapes and his fists are clenched. The artist's attraction to pain and fear is seen in his famously violent brushstrokes. Bud takes from these influences and grounds his interpretation in widely relatable experiences. He shows an aversion towards being overly serious. Ameng holds a history of illegal painting, of vandalism and anarchy. Moving to canvas, he echoes the grit of urban art. This composition takes a light approach, poking fun at institutions and the church. The details on this Pope's throne have a spray paint-like texture, juxtaposed against diamond wallpaper in an old fashion. The piece falls into a movement relevant to modern times, with touches of the artist's personal tastes. Bud takes the same stance as he does with graffiti, making art unabashed and defying the man. He recently held solo exhibitions, Who Are the People in Your Neighbourhood, at Archivo Gallery in 2019, and Humorous Fractures at Pinto Art Museum this 2020. All the different portraits reimagine a single Pope, but they represent an establishment much bigger than the painting. Over time and across movements, these artists have created starkly different narratives, making their own unique portrayals that reflect their own selves. <laughs>